Thanks so much. So if you're having trouble paying off those student loans, you want to hear this next story because we're going to meet someone who did and he did it in one year. Before we introduce him, though, we want you to take a look at these staggering numbers about student loan debt from Pew Research. By the end of June this year, Americans owed more than $1.3 trillion in student loans, far more than what they owed a decade earlier. Four in 10 adults under the age of 30 have student loan debt. Other research says the average amount is about $30,000 per borrower. And that's the amount that Phil Rischer, founder of the Young Adult Survival Guide, website had to pay off and you did all of this in a year. I'm, it's just unbelievable. It's astounding. So you graduated from college in 2012. You're from Montgomery County. Yes. And you know, like most of us, we were talking our first jobs. We don't make a whole lot of money. So talk about your circumstances and then we'll get into what you did to accomplish this. Yes. Yeah, so when I graduated college, I was making about $48,000 a year. Mm -hmm. And so each month that was about $3,000. And so I had 30,000 in student loans, and so I set a goal for myself to pay that off in 12 months. Wow. And so that means I would pay $2,500 each month. And so since I was making about $3,000, I had to figure out how to live off $500. <laughs> and so budgeting is a big component that goes into that mm -hmm. goal. So we were going to talk about you have a five-step guide that's going to help a lot of people. Tell us about that guide um, that can help some of us cut down these loans. Yeah, so I also have it on the website, uh, but the guide is Essentially, you got to set goals. Mm -hmm. And so if you want to pay off loans or pay off debt or save money, you need to set a goal. And so the first step is to set a goal. And then you have to do things that are different. If you want different outcomes, you have to do different things. Mm -hmm. Next, you want to set a budget to meet you, that matches your goals. Okay. And then you have to control your mind every day. Why am I going to work today to reach my goal? And then ultimately, you have to know why. Everyone tells me they want to save money, but why do you want to save money? Why do you want to pay off debt? You have to have that driving factor. Absolutely. Goals and budgeting, for sure. Uh, sacrifices are a big part of this too. <laughs> like for myself, I try not to eat out as much. Yes. So talk about some of the things that you did sacrifice wise, you know, to help you save some money. Of course. So, you know, when you graduate, you're on this high horse that you're going to be independent and go out and do your own thing. Mm -hmm. And so one sacrifice that I made was uh, I actually had to call my dad and ask if I could move into his basement because mm -hmm. I never lived with him before. So I lived in this cold, dark, damp basement for three years. The first year I had to negotiate a contract where I was an on-call babysitter for my younger brothers. Wow. I would do the dishes. And uh, that's not the most glamorous position to be in when you're a 22 year old guy. Right? But just something to rake in a little more cash, right? Yeah. If you decrease your expenses, then you can save more or spend more. Mm -hmm. And so that was kind of my strategy was make some sacrifices now so that later you mm -hmm. can live like different, different. I read one of your posts. I got a chuckle when you talked about how what you meal prepped for most of the week and then Fridays <laughs> on Fridays, that was your day. You had like the same meal all yeah. the time. So, tell so, us about that. so yeah, when I was one thing that I did to de decrease my expenses was every single day I brought my lunch and my coworkers used to laugh because I would read books and bring my lunch. And then every Friday I would go out to eat and treat myself as a little treat. And they started calling it yum, yum Fridays. <laughs> and so every day when I would come in, it was yum, yum Friday. And then they started to get into it too. And we would all go out to eat and have a good time. Wow. And, and before we let you go here, something I love, you purchased a condo in cash after you paid off your school loan. That is a huge accomplishment. How does that make you feel? That was one of my big goals and I was really, really proud of myself for that because I live in Montgomery County and things aren't cheap there. Mm -hmm. And so when I stuck to my goal and I hit it, uh, it, was, it was an amazing feeling. I bet, oh my gosh. Well, that's great. Goals, budgeting, you have all of this helpful information on your website. We're gonna get that information up on our website, WSA9.com. And again, Phil is the founder of the Young Adult Survival Guide and you have some awesome tips. Thanks so much for joining Thank us. Thank you for having me.